Hello YouTubers. Well, I thought I'd do a little tabletop review. Um, haven't really done a review before, um, but I recently started carrying this uh, Leatherman Squirt um, on an everyday basis. Uh, I actually find some of the things useful, especially the pliers. Uh, a while back I got this Gerber Vice and I I admit I bought it because it was cheaper than the Leatherman and I was kind of disappointed in it. Um, the, the actual uh, case on this is real clunky. These little things right here are awful sharp. Uh, when you hold it in your hand it's uh, not very comfortable. Uh, the Leatherman is about a half an ounce less and it has a much more streamlined uh, handle on it. It has pretty much the same uh, tools in it. This one has a little serrated knife and a regular knife, bottle opener, and a little file and I guess this is supposed to be a screwdriver. Could maybe pass for an awl, I'm not sure. Uh, plus the pliers, which I can't do right now because I only got one hand. Um, anyways, I was never really happy with it. Um, one day uh, I met up with uh, Faro uh, Allen on uh, uh, Faro on YouTube, and Allen was nice enough to give me the Leatherman PS uh, Leatherman Squirt PS4, and man, I carry this thing all the time now. It is really a useful little goodie. Uh, it has a really nice file, very sharp little knife, uh, has the screwdriver slash bottle opener, um, another little file nail, like a nail cleaner and a uh, file and probably a small uh, screwdriver tip on it and the cool little scissors. Now I'm going to turn this off just for a minute and uh, open both of these up so I can do another comparison. Okay, I got both of these open now. Um, you can see how far this one is apart. I mean, man, you really have to reach to at least, I, well I have small hands, but you have to really reach to uh, close these up and then there's this sharp edge on it. I, it's not like razor sharp but it's, it's it kind of sticks in your hands so uh, it's not a very comfortable tool. Uh, the uh, Leatherman is a little closer together and a little easier for my hands to manage and I, I gotta tell you it just feels better in the hand. Um, this uh, you can actually get on the Gerber web's website, I think it's like $12.95. The Leathermans run right around in the $30 range. You might be able to find them cheaper different places with a search. But uh, anyways, uh, hands down, this one goes away. This one stays. Love the Leatherman. And thank you very much again, Farrell, for uh, giving this to me. I really, really like this a lot. Alright, well that's my first tabletop review and I hope you liked it. Thanks for watching.